Hey, what is... Wait, hold on one second. There's something wrong with this intro already, and I'm gonna fix it. Hey, okay, okay. Now we fixed it. Let's try this intro one more time. What is up? To my YouTube family. I'm Alex Agrella, and welcome back or welcome to an episode of Recruiting Board. This is the eighth week in a row I am uploading, bro. That feels so amazing to say. We're killing it, guys. Thank you again for showing the support on this channel. Subscribe to this channel. Join the RB Army. Like I say every week, we're blowing up on YouTube. And if you look at the numbers, we have been. I provide some great content every single week for you guys. There's not much longer left in the season, but the next few games are going to be insane. We got playoffs coming up. Playoff football, baby. So you know you got to hit the thumbs up and subscribe to this channel because I'm going to keep you in the loop with everything that's going on during the playoff season. We're going to be going to great games, and I'm definitely still going to go to a Thanksgiving game. That's how we do here. So today, I am going to Swampscott, Massachusetts, and we are going to see Swampscott versus Masco. So, I already have a Masco game on this channel, but I have wanted to see Swampscott play. They are undefeated at 7-0 entering this game, while Masco has one loss, and as we saw, it was to Marblehead. Hey, Marblehead Swampscott play on Thanksgiving. Am I going to go to that one? Don't know. Will I go to Prep versus Avarian? Don't know. Let me know in the comments below. Anyways, both these teams, as we know, there's plenty of talent on Masco. When they played Marblehead, they just basically, they had the lead, but they weren't able to step on the gas and shut Marblehead out. They got to clean up those errors. They haven't lost since that game, so I'm expecting them to show out. This is a huge game for them. Swamp's gone, on the other hand, they're just paving dudes recently. They got a running back that I really am excited to see. Bascone, who is killing it. Who, if you go watch his huddle, that dude is an absolute dog. Swamp Sky is definitely a senior-led team. So this is going to be a smash mouth game. You're gonna see Masco come out. They're gonna be running the ball as well. A little wing T action, but Richardson can also drop back and sling it from the shotgun. I'm excited to be bringing you this game. We're gonna keep giving coverage to these local teams here. This is a community thing. This is one thing I wanna say. A lot of people ask me, like, why I do this. One, the players. You guys are awesome. I want to provide you you and your family's memories for a lifetime. This is a community thing, too. Community is huge to me as a person. And I feel like when you go to these high school football games, it's a community event. And it should be documented. Before the game, I am going to try a sandwich from Flip the Bird. So Flip the Bird, it's a local chain up here on the North Shore. They have locations in like Beverly, out here in Swampscott. And I'm trying to think where else, but there it is a local chain actually started by an Endicott College graduate. Shout out to Endicott. And they serve like fried chicken sandwiches here. And I'm extremely excited to try this place because I've never have tried it. A lot of my coworkers rave about this place. So I really want to try it. I'm going to give you a review of it. I'll see if they're cool, if I can record in there. You just like last week, it's going to be a lot less messy than the roast beef. I'm doing roast beef last week, chicken this week. What is next week for Alex Agrella on this channel? One thing's for sure, after this season, it's called the diet, bro. I'm getting right back on that diet grind. It's actually funny. I flip the bird here. It's literally right next to the orange theory, like... So after you eat a fried chicken sandwich, go to Orange Theory right next door. It's getting cold out here in New England, but you know I'm still going to be out here filming the content, making sure you guys are informed. So let's go in. Let's get some Flip the Bird. Let's fill up before the game. The game's at 7. It's like 5.15 right now. So we're going to fill up before the game. Head on over the field and watch some Friday Night Light football, baby. All right, guys. We're inside Flip the Burn. Shout out to the managers and the staff. They let me record in here, so that's great. So you guys told me you wanted me to come here. So I am getting Nashville Hots on the Nashville Hot. We got Nashville dip fried chicken with some shredded lettuce, chow chow, and bayou sauce. Again, thank you all for the suggestions on Instagram. If you aren't following me on there, definitely follow me at Recruiting Board. 
on Instagram. So if you are in the Swampscott area or the North Shore in general, come out here to flip the bird. Support the local business. Thank you so much to the staff again. You guys are awesome. And let's get right into the food. Y'all, this thing is monstrous. Jeez. Yeah. This thing is huge. <laughs> that was really good. You did me right, Abe. Hey. What up? We're on the field. Swamp Scott versus Masco. Again, another episode here on Recruiting Board. Like and subscribe, just like always, like every week. This is gonna be a good matchup here in the North Shore. Go out and support your local high schools, no matter where it is. It's going to be playoff season soon, guys, so definitely go out and support your local high school team. These guys are gonna be practicing in the cold, so make sure you're out there supporting. It's only a couple of dollars to come and go to these games, so it's gonna be a great time these next few months. I'm gonna be covering the games the rest of the season. In. There's not too many left, but they're all going to be high dramatic playoff games. All right, guys. Masco versus Swamp Scott. Friday night lights. Let's get into the highlights. <laughs> oh, and shout out to Brando. Brando, again with the <laughs> man, again. You kept it on again, bro. <laughs> hey, the reason why Brando's helping me out is because he actually screwed yeah, me. No. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's what he's been telling me.
and help. Ideas for Sunday. At the 19 yard line. What what are those ideas? Yeah. I remember I was talking to Anthony and Ronald about this. And I remember that they 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 came up with an idea that they either they were gonna put the shots in the Congratulations, guys. You know, talk about this win. You know, what a way to. This is the end of the regular season. It's huge. I mean, finishing this 8 0 was huge. Beating down, you know, fourth place in D3, Masco, huge. You know, we came up with forms like we want to do every week. Line stepped up, receiver stepped up, made plays. Defense was huge tonight. 
huge play by defense, and guys like this is what wins us the game. So. Man, so, yeah, you were paving the line. Like, I feel like it was just one of those games where the, yeah, they couldn't the, handle us. I think we came out and executed. I think we beat them in every area of the game, special teams, offense, defense. And I don't know. We had a good week of practice. It was wet all week. We were working hard. We were out there every day. And, like, we just came in here and got it done. It's our home field. 8-0. Yes, sir. Let's go. 8-0. <laughs> so what's the Let's message go. moving forward now, guys? Because, uh, you know, this is the end of the regular season now. You know, fresh start. 0-0. No wins yet. We just want to come prepare, you know, first-round playoffs next week. We just want to take it step-by-step, day-by-day, and just keep performing like we do. We're not losing. We're not losing. You heard it here. I love it. No so, uh, it. How would you guys describe your styles of play on this team? We got some beast linemen. This kid right here, biggest dog on the field for the 10 years I've been playing with him. He's been the best player I've ever played with. You know, all the skill players huge, the whole line huge. You know, we just step up, want to play every week. The thing about our team this year is we all want it. There's not one guy on the field that doesn't want it. And since we all want it, we're winning games. You guys are both hey, seniors, right? Yep. <laughs> oh, yeah, I should have ran back that pick six, but I can't. I'm, I'm a lineman. I can't, I can't catch. <laughs> yeah, right, you, this is a senior-led class, so what's it mean? Yep. You know, this is final year here at Swamp Sky. I mean, most of us, you know, we've been playing together since the first grade. It's, it's been a long time together. We have these yeah. crazy bonds all together. It's huge. Finishing this, you know, it's always just been a dream of ours to just keep, you know, all the way, Gillette, you yeah. know, but that's, that's the picture, but we have to keep taking it week by week. I love yeah. it. I, I, yeah, you guys want to shout out your families? Yeah, uh, shout out to you know my fam, my dad, my mom, all five siblings, my auntie Mia. So go ahead. Same goes for me. Shout them out all. Of them. <laughs> <laughs> Where, what's your Instagram and Twitter's? Xavier two on Instagram. Sounds good. Thank you guys. Have Thank you.